A major win for the family of Corinne Gaines. A special appeals court just ruled in favor of her family in an ongoing wrongful death lawsuit. Hello, everybody. I'm Rick Ritter. And I'm Denise Koch. You may remember back in 2016, the then 23-year-old Gaines was shot and killed by police during an hours-long standoff in Baltimore County. Ever since, her family has been fighting for justice for her. And WJZ is live tonight. Rachel Menentoff with these breaking details. Rachel just spoke with the family's attorney who talks about this newest ruling and what comes next. Rick and Denise, originally the family was awarded $38 million settlement from a grand jury in 2018, but a year later that decision was reversed by a Baltimore Circuit judge. And today's ruling essentially says that judge is wrong. Corinne Gaines was shot and killed by Baltimore County Police in 2016 during a six hour standoff at her Randallstown apartment after pointing a shotgun at officers trying to serve an arrest warrant. Her family sued Baltimore County police saying that officers used excessive force when they fatally shot her and injured her five-year-old son. The Gaines family attorney says the next step is to go back to court to figure out what's next in terms of what the actual award will be. He says he spoke to Gaines' mother today about the decision. I spoke to Ms. Dormius just a few minutes ago and she wanted to say that she knew that justice is on the wings for us and that we would win this case and she's very excited. She's sorry she couldn't be here today, uh, but she's very excited. She was even shaking as we were talking on the phone. We did reach out to Baltimore County today, which sent us a statement saying they are reviewing the opinion issued today. We're live in Baltimore tonight. I'm Rachel Menatoff for WJZ.